Hello YouTube, this is Learn Tutorials, and welcome to your second GIMP tutorial. Now, before we get started doing cool um, photo stuff, I want to just get a couple things set up. So, um, you can see that um, this and this are two completely different windows, and this is really annoying. So, to fix this, go to Windows, and click on Single Window Mode and I'm just going to get it in full screen so um, it should look like this if you want to have it the other way you can but this is the way I'm going to be doing it and also go to edit and click on preferences and if you know how much RAM your computer has then, div um, then take 75% of that and uh, put it in right here um, tile cache size um, but since I am having a screen recorder on at the same time, I think I'm going to do 2 gigabytes. Um, but you know, you can put 3 or whatever, but it'll make it run a lot faster. So press OK, and um, then we're ready to go. So to make a new project, click on File, New, and just um, put whatever you want in here. I'm going to put, what was it? 1920 1080 ok and then it'll give me a blank canvas which is the picture that I'm going to be working with so I'm just going to um, take the paintbrush tool right here and I'm just going to scribble some stuff all over it and um, so yeah this is pretty ugly but um, this isn't really the point of the tutorial. What I'm going to be showing you guys is how to save a uh, project. What was it? Um, a project file and a uh, export it as an actual image file. So, to save this as a project file, go to File, um, Save, or Save As. It doesn't really matter, but um, put in whatever. So you know, whatever. Dot XCF. So um, so then click save, and then it'll save it as a project file. Now, what a project file does is that if you if I um was working on a really um hard picture, and it was taking me a while, and I wanted to um finish it later, but or something like that, then I would save it in a project file and then what, the next time I open the project file it would look exactly like this so that is what a project file does and it is really useful for big projects and stuff like that so um, to export it as an actual image go to save I mean sorry export or export as either one so um then uh, click what whichever um, type you want to export it as I'll just click this and then uh, click on export um, just press export again and it should be uh, exported so if I go out of GIMP and if I uh, type in whatever um, it'll have uh, both of them so if I open the image file it will look like this. It'll be the exact same image, but it'll be an actual image file so I can, um, you know, like set it as my wallpaper or something. Not that I'd want to, but, uh, you know, I can. Whatever. Okay, and also what this does, um, it's project file, and um, it will uh, load in one minute. See you then. Okay, so now um, GIMP just loaded, and um, this is from opening the project file, and as you can see, it is the exact, um, exactly how I left it when I saved it. So, um, so that's the end of this tutorial. Now you know how to save uh, project files, export um, them to actual image files, and how to um, set a couple things up in GIMP. Uh, have a nice day. Uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial.